Welcome to the Hour of Code in Tuscan Unified. In this video, you will learn about the Tinker Hour of Code website called PlayLab. Teachers, start by creating an account and then click on this button to create a classroom with a classroom code. When students use the apps on the Tinker PlayLab website, they will eventually be prompted to add a classroom code to log in. However, they should be able to try out any of the apps right away. So let's talk about a couple of them. Let's start with Candy Quest. Notice that this is a beginner level game. In many of the games, you get to pick your character and even change their features. Once the game begins, directions will be provided on how to play or code the character to move. On this very first level, you will see that you will drag the walk block of code and attach it to the on start block. And then you're going to add another walk block of code so the character moves two spaces. There we go. The character eats the candy. That's the goal of the game. As you move up in levels, new blocks of code will be provided, and it does get a little bit harder. Here we have to jump over thimbles to earn candy points and get to the end. There we go. Go ahead and play Candy Quest as one of your first games if you are a beginner coder. The next game we'll look at is called Dragon Blast. In this game, you will also choose a character by tapping on the A to make it hatch. You will see that this app has a very similar coding strategy where you will drag blocks of code into a sequence and you will run that code to get to the treasure. Okay, I'll let you take it from here. There are plenty of apps to explore in the Tinker Play Lab Hour of Code. Good luck coders and enjoy the Hour of Code.